Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to show you guys how to set up your Kai MPK Mini with Ableton Live. So the first thing that you want to do, obviously, is make sure that you have your Akai MPK Mini plugged into your computer. And once it's plugged in, you should see it light up. So make sure your track is armed, and now you can go ahead and look for a sound that you want to play with your MIDI keyboard. I'm going to go ahead and choose Old School Roads. I just double clicked to add it into the MIDI track. And now I should be able to play it with my Akai MPK Mini. And if for some reason you don't hear sound coming out, I would recommend going to Live and then going to Preferences and then going to Link MIDI and go to the MIDI ports. Then you would go to the track, make sure that's turned on so you could play sound with your keyboard and make sure that remote is turned on as well just in case you want to control something in your DAW with your MIDI controller. So an example of that would be, let's see, I'm gonna grab the auto filter really quick and I'm gonna go to MIDI. And then I'm going to go to what I want to control with my MIDI controller. So I'm going to click frequency and then I'm going to turn a knob. And now the knob is selected. And as you can see, this is where the MIDI mappings that we've created will show up. So I will be able to control the frequency of the sound. And now that I play my MIDI controller, I can control the frequency with my knob. All right, you guys, so that's it for this video. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment and I will get to it as soon as I can. I hope this video was helpful to you guys. If it was, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to keep up with more videos, and I will see you guys on the next one.